people are so negligent about their lives if people who are put in quarantine escape if people uh, you know assault uh, uh, teams of health workers i i'm not sure if we want to save ourselves from the fallout of the pandemic and the way this tam thing and i am not expert in, in virology or or in public health or any of these things but the the explosion of cases in the last few days uh, makes me believe that have we actually managed to get over this entire crisis uh, are we going to be able to flatten the curve so to speak uh, or uh, are we going to have uh, and and i think punjabi is again a very good uh, uh, language to explain this in the old days there is this this is there is this old story of this guy who commits a crime and who goes to uh, you know who's presented before maharaja ranjit so maharaja ranjit singh tells him okay fine that you, you have to get a punishment so you can either get uh, 100 chitar chitar is the leather part of the sandal which really stings very hard and the punjab police uses it very often uh, he says so you can either get a 100 chitar or you can eat a 100 onions so the guy thinks that okay fine why the hell should i eat um, you know get the chitar uh, and get myself lashed with the chitar i'll go in for the onion so he has 10 onions and then he starts you know his whole body starts smoking so he says no i can't have onions i'll go in and take the chitar so he takes 10 chitar and it starts hurting the hell out of him so he goes back to onions in the end he has both the 100 onions and the 100 chitar so i think i i'm i'm hoping that this does not happen with our economy post covid that we suffer the loss which we are going to suffer and we don't have any real estimate of what is going to be the a cost that the economy is going to suffer and we suffer the chinese virus and people so i think uh, that is going to be a very critical uh, factor going forward uh, in deciding how our strategic environment actually plays out